welcome speech. And chatting evening, ladies and gentlemen, especially to you, Jie Yong. Today, Jie Yong shared about giving back to the society, and I hope to give back to him with my evaluation. So I will first share about the areas of excellence in his speech, which makes it so impactful and beautiful. So firstly, it's his sincerity and authenticity. So if you were to notice his facial expression, his voice, his stance, it all radiates this genuine aura. And when you are genuine, people want to hear to hear you more because it makes us feel very comfortable when you speak. Well done on that. And not only that, you reinforce the audience connection because we are we know that you don't put up a front. It's genuinely you yourself, and that's something we can all learn from you. Being a sincere speaker. And secondly, I would like to commend you on your smooth and systematic structure. You start off with an introduction, followed by internship, followed by experience, followed by your encounter. And you reinforce this structure with what you what we call signposts, which was mentioned by the previous evaluator, because you mentioned things like two reasons. So all of this acts as guides, and it's important for us to have an organized structure to our speech, so that we will not be lost in the sea of content. So congratulations on having this structure, which makes us absorb your message more accurately. And last but not least, you also shared a very relatable topic, namely internship. And giving back to society, something we all experience before. Because I guess most of you here require to go through internship, and most of you here give back to society one way or another. And with that, we are able to draw the dots and connect to your speech more. If you have shared something like quantum physics or statistics, maybe most of us will not relate on because it's too complicated. But you share something simple, something all of us understand. So well done on that. Now I would like to share some areas to enhance on. So that you can bring your speech to the next level, and it will be as easy as A B C because A stands for amplify your vocal volume and variety. I encourage you to project your voice so that you can establish yourself as a confident speaker, like some of them did, and add in some variety so that you can emphasize on the emotions because vocal variety brings out the emotions at that point in time, and your speech has so many emotions in it. So use variety to your advantage. And B for blend in dialogues into your speech, because dialogues can enhance the theatrical elements in your speech. For example, your encounter with the big client of yours. How did the sales go? How did you communicate with him? When you share a dialogue, it transforms your speech into a story, and the audience are able to visualize with your experience more. And C for call to action. Have a takeaway point for the audience to bring home today. So that we can place it into action immediately. Consider this, ladies and gentlemen. Today, I have shared with all of you an internship which I found meaning in. So I encourage all of you, when you find your internship, find something as fulfilling and as genuine as mine, and you will have an amazing experience. So now the audience has something which we can take home, and that can galvanize us into action. So in summary, I would like to congratulate you because your speech is indubitably sincere <laughs> and it's smooth and systematic. You place a relatable topic, but do consider amplifying your voice in terms of the volume and variety. Blend in some dialogues and add a call to action. So Jie Yong, congratulations on finishing your icebreaker. You are indeed a sincere speaker. Keep that fire burning, and I look forward to your pleasant sharing. Thank you. Thank you.